must move! I have your Malakas tokens. No more games, no more schemes to rob me of my Rachmi. It's time to slay a Minotaur! Absolutely, Mistios. Uh, no problem. But first, perhaps you'd like to buy back your exquisite, uh, finely crafted trial tokens? This offer will expire in... Uh, by the gods! They uh, make for fantastic gifts. Strange, but I would like something to remember Pefka by. And all that's left is facing our star attraction himself, the Minotaur! Are you ready to meet your doom? If your pre-trials are anything to go by, yes, yes I am. Well, good, great, I, I, I want you to fight the Minotaur. You'll find the beast in the depths of the Cave of the Bread, on the Zizki Plateau. Two other warriors have just completed their pre-trials. You can speak to them for more information. They'll join you when you're ready to, you know, die horrifically. You've come all this way. Join us. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have a very important uh, pottery lesson to attend. So... <clears throat> And you must be the... warriors. Look, brother! The final member of our Minotaur hunting party has arrived! When the beast sees our assembled might, he will moo miserably in fear! Do Minotaurs moo, or...? If it's all right with both of you, I'd like to strike the killing blow. Or can we at least say I struck the killing blow? I'm willing to haggle down to... played a key role in distracting the Minotaur while allowing the killing blow to be struck. The Minotaur is a mythical creature. Only someone just as mythical could slay it. You're talking about me, right? The only myths about you, little brother, are the ones Pater paid to keep quiet. Ugh, this can only end well. Are you ready to ride? Let's slay a Minotaur. Leandro says it lives in the Cave of the Brave, on the Victi Plateau. I say, let the Minotournament begin! The Minotaur eats humans and lives right next to the population of Pefka. How are they all still alive? Perhaps the diet of Pefka disagrees with you. Oh, 
I should check on my brother. The baking business can be quite fierce, you know. Good luck. Ah, Pefka. Home of heroes. Whoever lives down here must be a monster. <laughs> Did the Minotaur just... Otherwise, death by hoof awaits you! Fear my move! Fear it? Malaka, I am going to start stabbing until someone tells me what's going on! There's no need for more blood. Just keep your horns away from me. And tell me what's going on here. You can take off that mask. Leandros? I told you nothing is what it seems in Fefka. I'm... happy to refund any expenses incurred. Please. It's my daughter, uh, Mara. Masked men are holding her captive deep in the canyons of Titi Plateau. Masked men? What kind of masks? Uh, white like marble, bleeding from their eyes. Horrific! The cult. They control everything in Pefka. Lured champions from all over with the promise of Minotaur slaying glory, only to swindle and ambush them down here in the dark. Honorless. If I don't do as they say, uh, Amara dies. If I take off my mask, or tell my wife, or ask for help, she dies. Tell me about your daughter. Amara. The sound of her laughter is sunlight on my skin. She is joy, Mistios. One night, the masked men took that joy from me. They needed my silver tongue to lure wealthy warriors to their trials. In Amara, they found all they needed to control me. You said the cult, yeah. the masked men, have your daughter in the canyons of Dicti Plateau? There are a lot of canyons. But only one holds Amara. There is a place called Zakros, an ancient ruin, and the bastion of the masked men's power. I go there every night, hoping to catch a glimpse of her. But I never have. 
I fear they keep her underground, where she'll never see the sun. How many men have you sent to their deaths with a speech and a smile? Thousands. More. But their lives will never outweigh my Amara. She's all I have. But now I have you. Don't I? You. You can free her from those Malakas masked men. She's your daughter. You must save her. But they'd cut me down. You think she'd want to see her father die? She would want her father to protect her. Coward! You're right. I'm a coward. And the man cannot be any more than he is. That's enough for me, but... It's not enough to save Amara. For that, I'll need your help. We will save your daughter. Together. Thank you, Mistios. Meet me outside the ruins of Zakros on Vitki Plateau. That's where my daughter is and where I must be. These masked men, they're organized and unafraid. Their greatest weapon is no blade, it's our greed. Every merchant, every man in his slave has enough crafty out of the charade to make greed us blush. The myth of the Minotaur makes us all rich, and we turn a blind eye to the cost.
Minotaur, it's only me, Leandros. You came. I was sure I'd fight alone. I'll stand with you, Leandros. No matter what happens today, Amara will be proud of her fun. I see you're still a Minotaur. I faced many of the Greek world's deadliest warriors in this mask. Granted, I was just there to distract those warriors with my roars and threatening gestures, so they could be ambushed and stabbed from behind. But wearing it makes me feel brave. You look like the one thing in the world Alcibiades wouldn't take to bed. Can you even see out of that thing? Mock all you want. When those Malakas and Zakros see this beast charging towards them, they will know fear! They must be keeping her underground. With hooves and heroics. We shall save her! But Zakros is well defended. How should we proceed? Quietly. I'll try to sneak in. Stay back here until it's safe. I can be stealthy. You have horns. <sighs> Go. I'll do my best to distract the guards. Where is your honor, you masked malakas? The Minotaur calls you. Come and face me. Show me your bravery. By leaving the safety of your impenetrable fortress and coming out into the open.
Find you when I know it's safe. Thank you. I'm generally thank you. thankful, Miss Dios. saving me.
saved me. Well? <gasps> Is that the Minotaur? Yes, that absolutely is the real, authentic Minotaur. It's all right now, Amara. No one will ever hurt you again. Not while I, the mighty Minotaur, am here to protect you. Pater? You think I don't know your voice? <sighs> Hi, honey. How could you even see out of that thing? <laughs> People keep asking me that. I waited and waited and... You weren't going to leave me here, were you? You were just working on your plan to save me, right, Pater? Of course. I was always coming for you. I just... needed to find something first. The people who took you, if there's anything you overheard, anything that could help me stop them... While I pretended to sleep, their leader spoke at a meeting place in Kidonia. I wrote down all the masked men's whisperings. Hopefully something in here will be useful to you. My friend, we're heading to my wife. She keeps a vigil for Amara at the warrior's rest. Come with us. See the gift you gave. Our family, together. After you. Amara! Amara! You're alive! Mater! My family, you did this? Thank Leandros. When the time came for action, he charged, despite being outskilled and outcostumed. He fought courageously. Your husband is no coward. Perhaps there are some heroes here. No one's ever won the prize of Pepka! Everyone who's died facing the Minotaur has had their drachmi go in the vault, growing year by year. And now, a tiny but well-earned portion of it is yours. Thank you for a... a tiny portion. Of course. Less taxes, reasonable operational expenses, and... I'll make sure all of it reaches your boat, Mistyos. You've earned it. <laughs> oh, and... Hmm. This is for you. A coward doesn't deserve to be the Minotaur. You do. Quite the compliment. Pevka is no longer safe for us. Freeing Amara will bring repercussions from people who are not known to be forgiving. But we're alive, and whatever future we have, we have it only because of you. Be safe. The cult has existed for decades, and will exist for centuries more. 